Hello everyone and welcome to West Coast Thrift Journey. So today I decided that I was going to hit up a couple of Goodwills and this is actually the second store that I decided to go into. I wasn't going to film but then I felt guilty and I wanted to bring you guys along on the journey. So these are some of the items that I found in the store and be sure to wait all the way till the end so you can see what my haul is. I'm so excited for you guys to see what I actually found in the store. So let's just jump into it and you guys can see what I saw today and I will tell you a little bit about it. It. So after seeing those really cute animals and those little wicker hand woven pieces, I decided that I would look at the pottery and check these out. They weren't exactly what I was looking for, but I wanted to show you guys what they look like. And then I spotted some baskets up here on the top shelf. This really colorful one was really cute and then there was this one that had a really pretty red tint to it. It looked a little bit older and it was a good deal but this basket was $6.99 and I really didn't feel like it was worth it but I thought it was really beautiful. So up next I spotted this really cute basket that you could hang your plant in. I have a couple on the patio right now full of beautiful plants for the spring and summer but I think they're a really great idea to pick up. So if you guys ever come across these coasters they always come in this little wicker basket and I think they are so cute and easy to store and actually really great for resale. So I do have a couple of these and I decided to leave them behind. Up next, I found this really beautiful flute. It didn't have a price on it. I was a little disappointed and when things don't have a price, they won't sell it to you unless maybe you find a, a manager that will be pretty nice about it and just go ahead and sell it. But at this store, I just didn't have time to ask. Wow guys, I am just loving the items that I am finding today. These are definitely going in my cart and for 99 cents, you cannot beat that. And these are a sneak peek to my haul that will be coming at the end. So up next, I'm going to check out the health and beauty department. I don't normally do that. It's not something that I really look for. My wife usually does and she brings me little things that we can use for the kitchen or for the bathroom and I've seen a lot of people on TikTok put their mouthwash and their toothpaste inside of these pumpers and I think it's a great way for you guys to be able to save money and purchase these that have never even been used for just a few dollars and put your toothpaste in your mouthwash or your hand soap or your kitchen soap in a glass jar with a pumper and buy it at an inexpensive price. So up next, we are gonna check out trinkets and vases. If you guys are loving this video so far, make sure and give it a big thumbs up and share it to your friends. If you are new to my channel, Welcome to my channel. I'm so happy you're here. Make sure and hit that bell so that you get all of my up and coming videos and make sure and binge watch all of my old videos. I post at least once a week, if not more. So let's see what else we can find on this aisle. I'm really excited for you guys to be along on this adventure and see exactly what I find at the end. I'm super excited for you guys to see it all.
I thought these teacups were so cute. They might just be espresso cups. And then I saw these little teacups and thought these were so precious. I actually think that I saw a piece of this design at one of the other stores recently. I'm gonna pop back into my videos and check it out. If you guys have seen it, make sure and leave a comment below and let me know. These little teacups are so 80s and I'm so excited to see them. I used to have some when I was a little bit younger. I'm now in my 50s. If you guys want to reveal your age, be sure and leave a comment below and let me know what you guys see and how you guys reminisce when you guys watch my videos. So I really hate to see pieces get separated and I try to always put them back so that someone can find the other pieces. I really hope that someone buys all of the pieces and gives them a happy home. So up next, we are going to check out the art. I'm really excited for you guys to see the pieces that I found today. And let's just jump right into it and show you guys everything that I found. The style of these pieces are so magnificent. I could not believe it. My mouth just dropped with every single piece that I found today. I called my wife and had her bring me more money. That's how excited I was.
So I'm so glad that I was able to share all of these pieces with you guys. It was just such a peaceful way of shopping, going through all of this art. I'm so glad that I took the time to do it. It took me over an hour to go through every single piece and get, get the best shots that I possibly could for you guys. So this is what I actually ended up bringing home. I am so very excited. I can't even explain to you. I actually had a sweater on because it was a little chilly out today. When I was excited in the store, the sweater came off. I was sweating, I was so excited. But um, these are the most gorgeous pieces that I felt like they had in the store. If I could have bought all of them that I showed you guys today, I would have, but I simply did not have the money. So I, like I said, I had to call my wife, Mel, and have her bring me some more cash so I could pick these up. And then I also was able to pick up a couple of other pieces, so let's check those out. Well, our cat muffin is so curious about everything that I purchased today. She's so silly and cute. Well, up next, I found these really beautiful little fans. I actually found them at the first Goodwill that I went to, and they were the only purchase that I found in that store. And then I found these really beautiful wood. I want to say that they are gazelles. Uh, leave me a comment below if I'm wrong. But anyways, guys, that is everything that I purchased today. I am so happy that you guys came along. And until the next time, you guys have a great evening.